Hey everyone, this is Michelle. I'm just doing a quick video to show you how to use uh, Twitter in your workflow. Uh, there's been a groundswell of a lot of support about um, why do we do Twitter? Why do we do Twitter at conference? Why is it important? So I thought I'd just do a quick run through of, of how I use it um, on a day to day basis, especially this week where there's so many conferences going on that are really great in, in emergency medicine and education. So you can see from our iPhone here, I use uh, the app here called Echophone. So you can see here, you can also use other apps called like Hootsuite, uh, but this is my app that I use. So you see here at the bottom row, there's a bunch of icons at the bottom, and what comes up first is the home stream. So you can see that I subscribe to a couple of um, accounts like SAM Online, San Francisco Giants, of course, um, and just a whole host of people that I recently picked up uh, who are making some really great tweets in the, in the past week. So here's the list. You kind of read through. You can read through pretty quickly and skim through what might be interesting to you that day. So how do you post a uh, new post? Let me just show you. It's as easy as clicking the new post button. And let's talk about Javier's uh, recent post on the blog, which actually compiles weekly tweets. So um, let's say at Javier. You can even take a photo. Or you could choose one from the library and attach it here. I'm still on the 140 uh, characters. Let's send that. Posting, and there it is. There's my tweet. You can see her here under mentions. Uh, mentions mean that these are just tweets where someone has mentioned you in their tweet out. You don't have to be following them. It'll just be flagged whenever you are mentioned. Um, so there's a lot of uh, responses. You go like, oh, how great. They responded to uh, to what I wrote. So, oh, sorry. Um, so there's a lot out there. You can respond to them. You don't have to respond to them. That's the great thing. There's also messages. I think as a matter of etiquette on Twitter, it's I try to keep as much personal stuff off, especially if I'm just conversing with one or two people. Messages are basically direct messages. Messages you're sending just to that one or two other people. So messages... Um, you can see here I've kind of been conversing with a lot of people. I was coordinating meeting up with different people at the conferences. Um, and, and then it gives you basically kind of a text message thread of, well, you can't really see it here, but you can see a text message thread of, uh, of our discussion. Um, what about lists? I don't really use. And then search really is, I think, the most important feature of this app because um, it allows you to search for people or what I search for is for hashtags. Hashtags are just... Um, labels that are attached to conferences or ideas that you want to trend. And again, you don't have to be following these people. So this uh, hashtag that I'm trending is uh, EMTOT, which is a relatively new hashtag called EM Tricks of the Trade. And so whenever they're cool clinical tips, um, I try to remember to flag them. And interestingly, it's gaining a lot of uh, uh, momentum on this. And people who have no clue who they are um, are using this hashtag. And a lot of times see seeing me for no apparent reason. Other hashtags, uh, so once you find one, you can actually save it. Save this hashtag so it'll be on a list. Normally it'll be here. I already saved this search. But if you go back, you can see the other things that I'm following. For instance, right now I'm at Essentials of EM. So let's look at this hashtag right now. And it's going to hopefully load up in a timely fashion. All the people who've, who've labeled their tweets with Essentials of EM. You know, someone's going back home to read uh, more EKGs after they heard Amol's talk. Very reasonable reaction. Other uh, other searches, you can see here, you know, simultaneously, I think a double AMC is still going on in San Francisco. This is the trend where I picked up uh, a lot of really fascinating people to follow. Um, you can see here, a ton of people, and, and, and across all the specialties of uh, medicine. So I think you could really network with some amazing people. Um, it's really quite an experience, uh, incredible experience. So take a look through. I think it's a, it's a fascinating way to collaborate and keep in contact and potentially meet uh, new people in the Twitterverse uh, to work on what you want to work on. Thank you.